on October 7th, in the early hours of Saturday morning, <clears throat> an atrocity, at, atrocity occurred in Israel whose effects have echoed all over the whole world. Children, elderly people, and even babies were forcibly abducted from their beds and taken into underground tunnels in the Gaza Strip. In some cases, the abducted children were taken, taken moments after watching their parents being brutally murdered. Many unspeakable acts were committed. Not only are they forced to live with this trauma, but they are also forced to experience in it in a strange, dark, and scary place without any international aid organization meeting with them so far. Our professional code as physicians require us to treat all patient and we see all the hostages as our patients. We are, <clears throat> thank you. <clears throat> we are duty bound to serve as their mouthpiece when they themselves cannot speak. We will continue to champion their cause when they have been silenced. You will hear today from the doctors sitting here some of the host about some of the hostages, those who have treated them, and know their medical background. I want to call again to our friends in the world, the physician, men and women, human rights organization, leaders and opinion leaders. Do not let the darkness defeat the light. Do not let darkness defeat the light. While the world is justifiably focused on humanitarian aid to Gaza, we have forgotten the serious health needs of so many of these hostages. Left in captivity, their medical condition will deteriorate and they may even die. First and foremost, I appeal to, to the, World uh, the World Health Organization, which oversees and addresses health and medical needs worldwide. Don't forget those who need you now more than ever. Don't let kidnapping of babies and the sick become a possibility in our world. I appeal to the Red Cross and the health and medical organization all over the world. I call on all leaders of the free world and the entire international community. Ensure the health needs of these hostages and bring them all home to their families. Bring hostages back home to their families.